power on the system by pressing the power switch on the back of the autoloader. If you are using a 5400N, press the Embedded Control Center Power button on the front of the autoloader also. Note that the system must be powered on when changing the ribbons. Open the printer by lifting up on the tab on the printer cover. The instructions for changing the printer ribbons are on the inside of the printer cover. There are two ribbon carriers, the print ribbon carrier and the retransfer ribbon carrier. There is one latch in the center that locks both carriers. Change the retransfer ribbon. Make sure the center latch is unlocked. Turn the latch counterclockwise to unlock it. Pull the retransfer ribbon carrier out of the printer. If you cannot remove the retransfer ribbon carrier, the Ramage autoloader is probably not powered on. Power on the autoloader to remove the ribbon carrier. Set the carrier down on its back with the rolls at the top. Remove the retransfer ribbon from the carrier. The take-up roll is on your right and the supply roll is on your left. Pull the supply roll up and to the left. Then pull the take-up roll up and to the right. Set the used ribbon aside. Install the new retransfer ribbon. Remove the ribbon from the silver foil package marked Everest Retransfer Ribbon. Hold the larger supply roll in your left hand and the smaller take-up roll in your right hand. Carefully unwind a few inches of ribbon. There should be about 9 inches of ribbon available between the two rolls. Position the ribbon under the carrier. Make sure the ribbon is centered, straight, and lays flat. Slide the back end of the supply roll on the left into the carrier. Press the front end of the supply roll into the carrier. You should feel a click when the roll snaps into the carrier. Do the same thing on the right side with the take-up roll. Make sure the ribbon is tight by turning the take-up roll counterclockwise. Slide the retransfer ribbon carrier into the printer. Turn the center latch clockwise to lock the carriers into place. Close the printer cover.